Hey, what's up everybody? How you doing? Welcome back to Carpool Gaming and another Destiny 2 Witch Queen video. Today we have another quest line, the report all to reflect. And in today's video, I'll show you all the steps to get this bad boy done and how you can get this quest started. So without further ado, thanks for watching everybody and let's get started. Now, you should see something pop up right there. That is the very first mission that you're gonna do on the board you see how the board works is you need to complete the witch queen campaign first and then you'll be able to come to the evidence board after you do a few more missions for finch and then you'll have these reports unlocked but they go one by one you can't complete one mission unless you do the one before so this is the second mission in the line of quest at the report board the report alter reflect first thing first pick it up from the board step two we need to bring the enamel to the new access point on the new throne world room of Savathun. So let's head over to Savathun throne world and let's head over to this location. Now, here's the thing ladies and gentlemen, it's a little tricky to get the very next part because you're gonna use your psychic abilities to start the quest. We need to line up a picture and that picture is gonna be of the witch cream. So you see, I'm doing it right now. I, I thought I had it done, nope. I had to repeat this process quite a few times, three to be exact, before it lined up. I mean, I thought that was a perfect picture of the Witch Queen, and nope, time ran out. So head back to the altar, pop it once again, and you basically just need to make the picture of the Witch Queen. So, I mean, like I said, I thought I did it twice, it didn't happen. and But it happened on the third time, like legit, I'm like, that's, that's Witch Queen. <laughs> and then Bungie said, hey, nope, try it again. So if you have some issues with this, trust me, that's why I'm showing you this. Uh, I, I did it I did it three times. I, I didn't really see the difference between all three, but it, it took it on the last time. I mean, I was happy for that, but you know, it is what it is. Might take you a few tries to get that done. But eventually, you'll get it done, and then it's gonna pop up where the real mission start. And that is through this portal. Hitting through the portal link, and there, there it is. And the new adventure has popped up. We have some puzzles. Yeah, back to the old puzzles. Now, she sees something pop up right there. That is a full step-by-step -step guide on how to complete these puzzles. Now, she sees something pop up right there too. That is how you can complete the next set of puzzles. You see, there's two different set of puzzles. There's these cylindrical cylinders right here to open up that door. Right, you think you're done? No, there's the cylindricals, and then there's the circles with the nice runes and the pillars as well. How this is gonna work is you wanna find out whichever one of these columns look different from the other ones, that is the one you're gonna shoot. So, if you see these symbols and they all match up, like all three of them, you're just gonna leave it alone, right? You just need to head over and figure out which rune symbol doesn't match on each one of these pillars and if it doesn't that's the one you have to shoot like i said just follow the guy if you're a little confused if your first time doing it, but it shouldn't be if, you, if you're here already you should know exactly what to do so that's exactly what i did head over to the different ones and just check them out and just see if they matched up or not see this one right here all of them was the same so i just passed that up went back over here looked at that one and that one's different and each time you shoot it, it's gonna pop up a symbol. Do that three times, and voila, just like that, the door is gonna open up, and we're headed to the next part, where we need to defeat the Lucian Archives. This is basically a giant eye that we need to take out, right? And there's gonna be a whole bunch of enemies. It shouldn't be too hard for you to complete that. But after you do, you pretty much are done. Head over here and view the memory from the Altar of Reflection. Good job, my guardian. You pretty much are almost done. Matter of fact, you're done. Just like that, you got yourself a weapon, and a weapon is going to be a high, powerful draw. So, you know, that's always a beautiful thing. From there, you need to head back to the Enclave and report back to the board to complete it. And then after that, you can go on to the very next mission. That's how it's gonna work, ladies and gentlemen. The report, Alter Reflect, is done. And that is your full step-by-step -step guide. Pick up your reward and head on to the very next one. So there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. I showed you a full step-by-step -step guide for the second mission from the evidence board. If you have any questions or if you get lost or if something's not working out quite for you, please, by all means, let me know down below. I answer all questions. 
But for right now, that's pretty much going to for the video. I hope you truly enjoyed it. Once again, if you are new to the channel, how you doing and welcome. Don't forget to subscribe right here at Carpo Gamer. Upload a wide variety of videos range from updates, tips and tricks, guys, news and a whole lot more. So hopefully you enjoyed this video. Once again, thank you everybody for all your love and support. And as always, I'll be seeing y'all in the next one. Later.